When Joe Dove took his elephants out on the road, he made each one hold fast with its trunk to the tail of the elephant moving in front to stop them from doing a bunk. He had 15 in all, so it was rather a job to get them linked up in a row, but once Joe had fixed them, he knew they'd hold on because an elephant never lets go. The pace was set by the big ones in front, it was surprising how fast they could stride. And poor little Aggie, the one that the bat had to run to, she very near died. They were walking one morning from Blackpool to Crewe. They'd started at break of the day, Joe walked behind with a bag full of buns in case they got hungry on way. They were travelling along at a rattling good pace over moorland and valley and plain, and poor little Maggie, the one at the back, her trunk fairly creaked with the strain. They came to a place where the railway crossed road, an ungated crossing it was, <laughs> And they weren't to know that the express was due at the moment that they landed there. They were halfway across when Joe saw the express. He came tearing along up the track. He tried hard to stop them, but wasn't much good, because an elephant never turns back. <laughs> he knew if he didn't do something at once, the train looked like spoiling his troop. So he dashed on the head and he waggled the buns to show them they best jury up. When they caught sight of buns, they all started to run and they soon got across at this gate. Except poor little Aggie, the one at the back. She was not but one second too late. The train came dashing along at full speed and caught her end on fair and square. She bounced off the buffer, turned it over heels and lay with her legs in the air. Joe thought she were dead when he saw her how she lay with the back of her neck to the line. He knelt by her side, put his ear to her chest and told her to say, 99. She twiggled her tail and she waggled her trunk to show him as she were alive. She hadn't the strength to say 99. She just managed a week 85. <laughs> <laughs> when driver and a man came down from the cab, he said, here's a nice idea do to see 15 elephants ruined for life by a clumsy great driver like you. Said the driver, there's no need to make all this fuss. There's only one it as I've seen. Joe said, aye, that's right. But they held on so tight you pulled back end draw of the 14. <laughs> Joe still walks around with his elephant troop. He got them patched up at the vets. But Aggie won't walk at the back anymore, because an elephant. Never forget! <laughs> <laughs>